Hello and welcome back to SF at Giants Recap and in today's game the Giants they lost to the Padres 7-4 in some late inning scoring because of some poor management and poor bullpen but that's what we're going to go over in today's video. Make sure to subscribe and like if you do end up enjoying and so there was no scoring until the bottom of the 8th where the Padres they scored 7 runs thanks to Brandon Dixon hitting a double, J Josh Bell walked in a run, and then Jake Cronworth, he doubled to make it 4-0, and then Will Myers capped it off with the three-run home run, making it 7-0, but in the top of the ninth, the Giants, they made it interesting. Brandon Crawford, he got a two-run single, and so did Joey Bart, making it 7-4, and with bases loaded, one out, I mean two outs in the ninth with J.D. Davis up, he hits a long fly ball, but just short of the short porch in the right field at Petco, and the Giants, they lose. There's a lot of hit-by-pitches, a lot of walks in that last ninth inning, thanks to the Padres' shaky bullpen and making it interesting, but we'll see what will happen. Um, the Giants, they are eliminated from the playoffs. That was a couple of days ago, but these games are still fun to see. How the team will go, and Kapler continues to mismanage the bullpen. Shelly Miller's been doing great, but you can't try to extend his arm. Uh, Sean Jelly, player of the game in my opinion, he had eight strikeouts today. He went five innings, allowed no runs, four hits, only walked one, and did really well. Shelly Miller, he did allow of the five runs, and then Harleen Garcia, he allowed two. And so, I don't know why Kapler keeps bringing in. Harleen Garcia, he's been doing terrible. He allowed two hits, two runs, and only and got us the two outs. Shelly Miller should not have been in there that second inning. You can't keep trying to extend a guy's arm. Shelly Miller's been doing great, but if you just keep trying to push him with his pitch count and everything, especially at the end of the season, it's not going to work out great, and it didn't work out here. Um, thankfully, these games are kind of meaningless. So it's just kind of to get everyone innings and stuff. But at the same time, you got to be practicing or managing for next year or else uh, nothing's going to change. So that is just my biggest complaint is uh, Gabe Kapler's mismanagement of the bullpen. But other than that, Crawford and Bart getting the two hits in RBIs. And we almost came back, which would have been really cool. But unfortunately, we didn't. We are 80 and 80 right now. Uh, hopefully we can pull ahead above 500. And so if you like this video, make sure to subscribe and like, and I'll see you next time.